Coach, 9500, coming back at you. Now you see how I got that jack right there? Right in the middle, and it's picking up the middle, and that leaves both tires like that, hanging down. Now that's what you want when you grease your upper and lower ball joints. Because when you grease your upper and lower ball joints, if you have your tires with all the pressure, when all the pressure is on the ground, it just pushes the grease right out. It doesn't actually get into the ball joints. It just pushes it out. So when you put the jack in there and you pick it up just enough on each side, like that, where the tires are hanging, so the tires are just hanging on both sides, like that, where there's no pressure on it, that's what you want. And then you can get in there and the grease will go right in. Perfect. And that's what we're going to do. I can get this camera here to... Focus right. Let's see here. Let's see. I'm gonna get that one there. This side. Shots. Get some good grease in there. Uh, here's the lower one. And the upper one is it's right there. I'm about to move you guys over here. Somewhere like that. Get up in here. Right there. It's right there on top. Give it a couple shots. That wasn't bad anyway. It's... A couple shots there, and uh, now I'll go over and do the other side. And uh, I got to do the tie rod ends. But uh, that's how you do your um, upper and lower ball joints. It takes pressure off them, you know, so the wheels are just hanging like that. I'm going to move over and do the other side. Uh, but, uh, yep. So I'll talk to you guys later. I got to do the other side and I get these hubcaps back on, and that will be it. And the other side is, we'll go over here. It's over there. I'm not going to film at all. It's just, I don't know if I got enough data on my phone. So, all right, guys.